What's the difference between a good actor and a great one? You mentioned Daniel Day-Lewis. He yeah. is out of this world terrific. Yeah. Or was before he quit. <laughs> Started yeah. making shoes. He's quit a few times. He may come okay. back again. I don't know. <laughs> um, I, I, think, I think the level of your commitment to the truth. A lot, a lot of people have this misconception that Oh, a- actors must be great liars. You can't trust a, an actor as a person because he's, he's a professional liar. Right. No, no, it's the antithesis of that. Okay. He has to be a professional truth teller in imaginary circumstances. It's telling the truth in imaginary circumstances. And how do you tell the truth? If you can't tell the truth and be truthful as a person, you'll, you'll never be a, a good actor. Oh my gosh. You'll never be able to tell the truth as an actor. Mm. And people know that. They, they respond to it, even if they can't, you know, dimensionalize that, you know, um, linguistically, like I, they can't describe what that, what it is that compels them to watch an actor. It's like, usually it's the truth of whatever that actor is bringing to their character, yeah. whether it's their own personality, you know, like their own, who they are off screen is the same as who they are on screen. There's a lot of actors, that's their thing. Daniel Day-Lewis is not one of them. He's one of those guys that he puts on a new face every different show he does. I aspire to do the same thing, and I, I hope when I, you know, if I, if I get to do more, like I, prior to The Chosen, I had done a variety of different characters on television shows that were vastly different. Um, that's the kind of work that I like to do. Um, even I did a movie called um, Jesus Revolution where I played this yeah. preacher character. Yes, I enjoyed where it. Where there's a, thank you, um, where he's, you know, he's this, he's not Jesus, but he loves Jesus, but he has his own personality. He had a different way of speaking than I do. He had a different mm-hmm. way of speaking than Jesus does, you know? For me, it's fun to put on yeah. those costumes. Now, I suppose that you probably couldn't have, even if they wanted you to shave your beard and cut your hair to look like a totally different character, it probably just helped the fact that you were meant to play a hippie, yeah. that you weren't allowed to affect <laughs> the hair. And Yeah, I, I, in fact, I could let it grow for several more months. Okay. Um, Hey, thank you so much for watching. Before you go, do us a favor, leave a comment, let us know what you thought of the video, like, and subscribe.